The former police officer who went to trial for his wife's death is now taking legal action of his own. Levi Chavez is suing multiple people at the Valencia County Sheriff's Department. Target 7 investigative reporter Nancy Laughlin has a look at the case and the emotional response from the man at the center of this new lawsuit. It has been nearly eight years since Tara Chavez died. That phone call to 911 unforgettable. Her husband Levi telling dispatchers he found Tara with a gun in hand in their home in Las Lunas. Oh my God, please tell me the okay, okay. Where did she shoot herself at? <laughs> What is the phone number you're calling me from? Tara's death originally ruled a suicide, but four years later, Levi Chavez was indicted for her murder. Chavez admitted he'd had affairs, lots of them, but said he was no killer. In 2013, a jury believed him, and elated Levi Chavez walked out of the courthouse a free man. I'm not guilty. I'm innocent. Bring it on. Tara's family had filed a wrongful death lawsuit against Levi, but Chavez told the court he was broke. Tara's family decided to drop their civil lawsuit. Now, though, two years later, Levi Chavez has filed a lawsuit of his own, this one against Valencia County law enforcement and officials. The lawsuit says there was no probable cause for the murder case against him. That it ruined Chavez's career and destroyed his reputation. The suit also says the lead investigator, former detective Aaron Jones, was on a witch hunt. Jones is fighting back, saying in part, I did the best I could to be a voice for her and her family. And an attorney for Tara's family says he's surprised Levi is now taking legal action. My recollection is, is that the spirit of the agreement was that no one was going to uh, profit from her death. Chavez's attorney says they are moving forward. Chavez has now been accepted to law school at UNM, and they are now seeking lost wages, employment benefits, and his legal costs from this case and the criminal case as well. For Target 7, I'm Nancy Laughlin.